right, man. We out here preparing for the video shoot. Figure I might as well get some footage. You know, like, today's the day the element, you know, video. So, woke up this morning for real for I got up, like, I got up by, like, like five. Woke up around, like, five. Let me brush my teeth and everything like that. And then, um... I had to go pick up the I had to go pick up the whip. Yeah, man. Like I just wanted to capture these moments. I just wanted to, you know, capture everything what I'm doing and stuff, man, because a lot of uh, you know, some artists don't do this and everything like that, man. You know, some artists don't don't want to show what they do before the video shoot and everything, man. It's more it's more to it. It's more to it than just showing up for the video shoot and everything, bro. Like I know for me I like to be hands on, you know, um uh, schedule was pushed out to uh the you know the to the executives and to the director and everything like that today um that i created uh and i feel like everything's gonna go smooth man you know all the other cars the lambos and stuff should be there um at the at the venue nice venue um it's gonna be like a family reunion setting family friends reunion and stuff like that but you know what i ain't gonna lie to you i'm sort of nervous because i don't i don't know how people gonna I don't know how the venue dude is gonna take things like because he know people gonna show up in bathing suits, but you always know it's like it's always women that gonna take it above and beyond. You feel me? I think at the end of the day, like my whole even though like the dress code was um freaking uh swimsuit, I think as long as people as long as nipples, areolas, and vaginas is covered, we good. So and that was that was like the number one thing that I put out. So I don't think nobody gonna come here looking crazy. I don't think nobody. I don't think nobody's gonna really just come here, come to the video shoot looking crazy, man. Because at first, for real, I hate for my security had to turn. Oh yeah, I got security there too. So, but I hate for the security to be like, yeah, you can't, you can't come in. You feel me? You done drove all this way. This, yeah, I mean, it's some distance. It's some distance. I tell you that. Damn distance. So. I'm gonna take y'all throughout the whole day, like for real, for real. I'm gonna show y'all what is. I'm gonna show y'all what what my days are like when I'm working. As you know, when I'm out here in these motherfucking streets, it's kid money. Cause kid money ain't lazy. I can tell you that right now. Kid money like to be hands on like a motherfucker. Shit. So I had to had to switch cars. You feel me? Had to switch cars on on, on them real quick, man. So it's like I got my uh, you no, know, I got Mrs. Money taking the uh. The Tesla out there to the venue and shit. Had to load that bitch up. Should put that shit, you know. But got like some equipment in the bag. Got the speakers and wires and stuff like that. And got the damn um, props, the damn water guns and shit. Um, yeah, man. Shit, I was just on the phone. I just got off the phone earlier with uh with the cook, with the chef that I hired out there, man. You know, to sit there, it's gonna cook for the people that's out there and stuff. Cook just for like 20 people. 20 people that's gonna be out there, it's like the VIP people, and then everybody else, you know, I'm just buying for everybody else, you know what I'm saying? So, I mean, hey, at the end of the day and stuff, man, it's all love and stuff, man, you know, I just make a pretty good time, too, man. It's just only like what 945 and everything, man. So, I gotta, uh, I'm headed up here to collect storage real quick. Um, I should be there by 10 and everything, man. So, yeah, I'm doing this shit, I'm doing good time, man. Yeah, man, I'm excited. I'm excited, man. I, I really hope that y'all get y'all feeling the energy that I'm giving, man. Cause, hey, make bread, but this is the day, bro. Like this, hey, this, this my bread. This the bread maker right here. This the bread maker right here with these videos and stuff. Like I know, I know what it seemed like. I know it feel like it seemed like damn, like kid, kid be spending money on this stuff and everything like that. You know what, man? You, hey, hey, look, you gotta spend money to make money. Don't be your dad, baby. You got you gotta spend money to make money. You know, shit, that's the only way that shit gonna work. You ain't spending and everything like that. I don't see how you how you making it, you know what I'm saying? So you gotta spend spend a little to make a little, you feel me? Spend a lot to make a lot, you feel me? So I'm most definitely excited to see to have everybody together. And then also I like to have all these different energies in like one like all this positive energy in like one area, man. Like I know we're gonna make something great. I just know it. I can feel it. I feel it within my soul, bro. Like my spirit and stuff, man. Like this shit gonna be phenomenal, man. I just can't wait. I can't wait to 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 where people come out there and they see like, damn, we got food out here. Like, we got like, we got a whole chef out here and everything like that to cook just for us. 
and everything. Can't eat fucking green. Like I got this whole chef to cook just for y'all, man. Y'all gonna eat good, you feel me? Y'all gonna, y'all, you know, we gonna be on some positive vibes. You know what I'm saying? Like I got a whole DJ out there that's gonna, you know, not just play, not just play my music. You know what I'm saying? But he gonna play, he gonna play everything. You feel me? Cause we trying to, we trying to keep that vibe. I love it, man. I love it. This uh. This is like my very, very first, first big ass video. I ain't never had no big, no big video like this. Like, I get tired of doing that little short shit sometimes, man. But I understand, you know, sometimes, you know, you just, that's like that quick bread, you know what I'm saying? But sometimes, you know, you, want, you really want to take the time to really pay attention to your craft, you know? And so that's pretty much what I'm doing, man. I'm just taking the time to really pay attention to my craft and everything like that and really put in that work and stuff, man. That's what this is. And luckily, I thank God that, uh, you know, he created, he, he put me in a position to where I was able to meet people with similar vision and stuff. And not only that, that's also willing to invest in themselves as much as I'm willing to invest in myself and everything like that, man. And that's wonderful, man. It's wonderful. And not only that, not only invest in themselves, but also willing to help out, help out others. It ain't always financially, right? It ain't always got to be financially. It's just the fact that you just got somebody that's there to be able to give you advice and be able to give you guidance and everything like that or share their experience with you so that way you can learn from their experiences so that way you don't go down the same motherfucking path and shit a lot of y'all motherfuckers i don't know why y'all like to y'all i don't know why if a motherfucker told you to go left if a motherfucker say i think it's better for you to go left because if you go right there's a lion down there and that lion gonna eat your ass up and everything y'all would still choose to go right y'all would still choose to go right like i don't fucking get it and everything like that like I don't get that shit. If somebody's telling you to go left because there's a line to the right and everything like that, then automatically you should just you should just want to just go left. You should you should just want to just go left. And then I mean, if shit goes sideways to where it's the point to where you went left, but uh, shit like you know it, it, it's it's fucked up. You gotta be careful. On, you gotta understand. You gotta be careful on who you trust and everything like that. But sometimes it's just like sometimes man, you just gotta roll the dice. And everybody, not everybody's out there to go. Not, not everybody is not out there to get you. I'm saying everybody's not out there to get you, you know what I'm saying? You really got genuine people that's out there that's really trying to help you out. That's really trying to give you guidance. That really want to see you succeed. You, yeah. We exist. Let me tell you that. Yeah, we exist. See, I had to make a stop. Got everything, you know. See, it's like uh it's eleven o'clock right now. Got the last bit of this shit that I wanted. So, getting everything in the car, and everything in, now, now I've set up to get there by 12, a little bit before 12, set everything up, and everything like that, man, I got, I got some more, some more of my, my crew setting up, and everything like that, so, yeah. I'll see y'all at the set. Yeah, yeah. Hey, I've been recording all morning. Yeah. So I got footage. Don't worry, I got the footage. You feel me? The life of kids, you know what I'm saying? The life of kids. Now to relieve stress, daydreamers on my chick told me lean back. 
was looking up shoe stars in the Maybach. Yeah, I got life, homie, on my mental. They also feel today was a phenomenal day, man. The people, so a lot of people came through. And showed love, supported, and everything, man. And, and really made, really made the element video like hard. Like straight up, bruh. Had some bomb ass gumbo. Some damn egg roll peach cobbler, bruh. And then I'm about to go home and eat me some damn cheesecake peach cobbler, bruh. Cheating on my dog like a motherfucker. And then it just, just for me to have to get up tomorrow. You know what? I don't even fucking know, bro. I don't know if I go to the gym tomorrow. I for a need to, though. I don't fucking know, bro. I don't see how I fucking feel. But, I probably for only do cardio tomorrow. But, um, today was a good day, bro. Today was a good day. Put up numbers day. I like this music shit, bro. I love this music shit. This shit hard. But yeah, this is behind the scenes, bro. Stay after, packed everything up, cleaned the venue and stuff, and yeah. It's been mad bread on this shit. You know, we used to have this shit done and everything like that, and it's gonna for sure pay off. Shit gonna for sure pay off. So yeah. I thank and I love y'all man for supporting me and following me throughout my journey, bruh. I love y'all for that. You know, I gotta let them know, man. I'm always in my element, man, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah. Okay, yeah. Look, hey, bring it back, Carl. Hard for me to get out of my element. Like, really, I'm feeling it. Uh, stacking the cheddar, you know that I'm getting it. Check me on the internet. Uh, moving so slightly, you don't see me elevate. My niggas, they celebrate. Achieving the goals and hitting the mark. 